Hey friends, Ash here with GenSense today, joined by my wife, Chelsea. And what we're gonna be doing today is she's going to be smelling and rating from worst to best, 10 of the biggest new releases that have come out so far this year. Are you up to the task? I am, actually I'm kind of looking forward to it because you've not really had me to smell a lot of them. Well, you have, but not really in depth, so. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of hard to <laughs> have you smell it in depth. I've just kind of run by and been like, how is it? And then, I, and then I run off. Yeah, <laughs> this is like a weird fragrance ninja. So uh, I've sprayed the dry downs already for these 10 fragrances. I'm gonna spray the opening also. I'm gonna have you smell two at a time okay. and you're gonna pick the winner and keep on doing that until we have a ranking of the worst new releases up to, or the worst new release up to the best. And I will not influence you, but I will judge you internally. Yeah, that sounds normal. Yes. So I'll have all of these new fragrances linked in the description. Some of them may not be easy to find in the US just yet, uh, but I'll try to link to all of them. I had to order some of these from Europe and pay a little bit extra, <laughs> but it's okay. So uh, are you ready to just like jump into it? Yes, I'm spying some of these down here. Oh, yeah, don't do that, don't do that. All right, so uh, we'll get it kicked off with this one. This is Y. Elixir, and uh, let's put that up against this one, Bad Boy Cobalt Elixir. Uh, let me spray the opening for these. Let me get out my weapons of mass destruction. What's crazy is like, I don't even remember even smelling either one of these. I know you've had me, like you said, drive by, smell them. Dry, but like, drive by? Drive by. Drive by. Smell them. Is the opening for But I don't one. even remember that. Yeah, they start to run together for you? Yeah. <laughs> there you go. So, uh, like I said, at this moment, I will say nothing about these fragrances unless you ask me to you know, question or something like that. Because ah. I don't want to influence anything. You know, usually, like, the YSL line in my mind The Y is, line? Yeah, the, the Y line is usually kind of, like, up above the... Uh, bad boy? Yeah, the bad boy line. But here, I kind of feel like... I don't know. These fragrances are like reversed. Actually, I, I like the Bad Boy more than I like the Y. So Bad Boy here, it's got a decent kind of a vanilla sweetness to it. Yeah. And um, to me, it reminds me of some other fragrances that have come out in the past, but I do like the way it smells. Yeah. And Y Elixir here, um, it's got that freshness in there, uh, that sweetness that you would expect from a, a Y fragrance. Uh, you could maybe say it's like a somewhat darker take on the original Y Eau de Toilette. Uh, but you're going to pick Bad Boy Cobalt Elixir. Yeah, that's, I mean, that little tinge of like vanilla that you smell in that. Yeah. I feel like makes it deeper and a little bit more interesting for me. Mm -hmm. So. Is that an upset? I don't I don't know if that's an upset, actually. I don't know. I don't know. Just in my mind, like I said, I hold the Y line above the bad boy line. Just Yeah, I do too. You know. Yeah. So Sorry I feel like boy. for me personally, that's probably an upset. Yeah, fair <laughs> enough, yeah. Before we hop to the next matchup, here are some codes that you can use to save money at a number of different websites. FragFlex, the code is GS11. Get you 11% off the whole website. It's a good discounter. And uh, Triple Traders, you have Gents Scents, get you 10% off. And Best Brands Perfume, you have uh, Gents, get you 10% off. Those two websites have a bunch of clone fragrances. So if you want clones, you can check those out. And then there are the other usual websites as well. All right, uh, next matchup. Um, trying to think what would be a decent one. Let's go with another elixir here. Mm. So we'll match it up against the scent elixir. The year of the elixirs. Uh, yeah, it's been elixir central here lately. Oh man, that is a bomb drawdown. <laughs> Woo. Here's these. Maybe we should uh, try to keep the opening drawdown separate, you know? Yeah. Like uh, opening to the right, try sure. down to the left, and then sure. I can respray the opening if you need. Very scientific here with this. See, this So just... three elixirs right off the bat. I like the opening of this just a little bit more, mm -hmm. but the dry down of this one is just, oh man, that smells good. Like that's really good. And that's the part that you want to be better. That's the part that's gonna stick around a little bit longer. And yep. I mean, I just, I find myself keep wanting to like go back and it's smell addictive. this again. Yeah, it is. Yeah, I, I actually really like that one as well. I'm not trying to chime in too much. I, I like both of these, but 
What I'm just saying. <laughs> but I like that one a lot too. Yeah. I thought you said you were gonna like internally judge. I'm, I'm, I'm agreeing with you. That means I'm, I, I don't have to keep it in the inside. <laughs> okay. When I go silent and just give you a stank eye, that means I don't agree with you. Uh, I'm actually gonna pick this one over that one. Oh, uh, that, okay. uh, that dry down is really good. So the scent elixir moves up into first place. Um, yeah, I'm okay with that. Okay. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> let's see. Next, let's get a, a fresher one here. Uh, so, Profundo, the new Profundo. I don't know why I moved that away because it's. Is this like the eau de parfum is what makes it a new Profundo? No, or... <laughs> there's a new. Okay, there's a new new Profundo coming out. Okay. Which is a parfum. Okay. This is the eau de parfum. Okay. But it's the 2024 edition of the eau de parfum. It's got a different bottle style, it's slightly different. It's not a massive departure. Okay. It's still Aqua de Jo Profundo, okay. right? Thank you for explaining that. Yeah. Well, I mean, it smells like an Aqua de Jo. <laughs> it does. It That's... smells like most of the other Aqua de Jo's that I've smelled recently. So it's like late breaking news. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, Aqua de Jo is Aqua de Jo, right? Yep. And to an extent, you want it to smell like an Aqua de Jo. You don't want it to smell like. Yeah, you know, you want that similarity in the line. Yeah. I mean, if it's going to be an Aqua de Jo, it would be really weird if they put out some like other Aqua de Jo that, you know, has like nothing to do with. Right. The they've, line. they've done that before, kind of. But yeah, yeah the, the ones that are more successful are usually like that. I'm going to have to go with the that. Scent? Yeah. So where do you put this, though? Because now we're going to have to start rearranging things. I'm going to put this at the first. Right. But this is going to be behind. Bad boy. Yeah. Oh, Aqua de Jo catching strays. You know how I am. I'm about Aqua de Jo. So I, I cannot, I can't sign off. Well, it's one of those things when Aqua de Jo is a classic, it's always going to be held okay. up on a you, pedestal. You don't have to explain it. Okay, good. Cause I didn't really want to anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Next up we have Stronger With You. Tobacco. So uh, coloration scheme, really nice here. Coordinated, mm -hmm. similar reds, similar golds. They uh, both obviously got the memo. What was the memo? To wear red and gold. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. So that's uh, Stronger With You Tobacco, a new exclusive edition. Um, so that's gonna be in the same line as Stronger With You Leather, Oud, Amber, and now Wacky Tobacco. Are you making sure it says tobacco on it? Making sure. Yeah. You want to contrast and compare a little bit? You know, I've been doing that. Making me think that you're skewing these rankings. It's not really my style. It's not necessarily something that's like, you know, up my alley. It doesn't smell bad. It's just not something that I'm really going to be going for, especially if you like have me to pick something for you. Oh, okay. That's going to be pretty low on the totem pole. Do you know off the top of your head what's stronger with you is that you like the most? You don't remember the names? No, definitely not. There's a good amount of them. There's a good amount. So I'd have to like smell them all and be like, okay, yeah, it's that one. That'll be your next video. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> you get to smell all the strong with yous. Oh no. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna put this one at the very back. You sure? Yep. Your smell why it looks for you. This is scientific. You have to do the science. Yep, go into the back. Oh no, rest in Get peace. Get to the back of the bus. Let's put it up against Phantom next. Mm. Phantom. You like it? Yeah. Hold it up to the light. You got a, a nice new little, little, little blue do. Little suit. Yeah, it's nice. I like it. <laughs> uh, so this is the, the new Phantom Intense. I don't okay. know what I'm trying to hand this to you, but oh, they changed the Paco Rabanne logo also. You see that? Oh, interesting. Yeah. It's got the little P and the R. Mm -hmm. Okay, I like it, but I'm not really super in love with the dry down. The opening smells good. It smells nice. Right. That one kind of matches this one as far as coloration goes. Yeah, actually it does. There's a lot of matchy matchy going on here. Yeah. Um, yeah, so this is going to have to stay at the top. Mm. This is just really good. Mm -hmm. But this one, mm -hmm. Yeah, it's contrasting and compare now. Smell around a little bit. Get your feet wet. Put your nose in it. Yeah. Just really breathe it in. <laughs> just really take it in. It's fantastic. That one's good for just all year. Mmm. Girl. So I am going to put this one behind this, but in front of that. Okay. Here we, here we go again. Here. Right? Is that, that's what yes, you said? Yes, that's right. Okay. Look, we are filling out the, the thing. 
Nice. We got four more to go. Okay. Green Stravaganza. Something different for your face. Yeah, I like the coloration of this bottle. Yeah, it's green. It's your favorite color. It is, yeah, actually. See, I need that. If I need to spray the opening of these again, you, really, you let me know. Or you do it yourself, you can do that yourself. Yeah, spray the opening of this one again. I'll do it. Okay. You want a new strip or old strip is fine? Old strip is fine. Man, that dry bag is so good. Here you go. Ah, so is the opening there. Jesus. This one's okay. Nothing really like super hardcore wowing me. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to think of where to put it. I'm Smell gonna it. put Smell it. it. Do it. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna put it behind the Y. y. Yep. Sad. He's a sad boy down there. Right. Okay. The Two scent more. elixir is just uh, cleaning up. No, it's got three more. Three more. Three more. Okay, right. Three. So next up, let's put it up against uh, the new most wanted. Okay. So this is the most wanted eau de toilette. Oh, that's a good dry down too. Intense. Uh, it has a turd for an atomizer. Oh, okay. Straight up turd. Check this out. Yeah, it could be worse. No, it couldn't. <laughs> <laughs> you spray it. Fill the okay. turd. Fill the turd. Uh, yeah, all right. Told you. All right, it I'll sucks. give you that It one. sucks. Mm. That's good. The dry down is really good. That one's pretty fresh. For a bottle that's all like blacked out, Yeah. it's actually pretty fresh. I kind of had a feeling that it might be because a lot of their bottles, like even the glass is really dark. Oh, you're talking um, about the, the other most wanted? Yeah. Yeah, that one's got a good amount of lavender in there. Yeah, that's good. It's mm. good, it's nice. Ooh. Question is, how good? Where does it fall? For right now, I'm gonna put it right behind the elixir. Yeah, so not very far down, actually. All right, scent elixir. <laughs> okay, let's put it up against uh, Paradise Garden. Nice, nice. You like his little leaf? I do. Mm -hmm. Smells good. Stylish. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Oh, that's a good opening. Yeah. It's a little like a like coconutty or something. Yeah. Just like a little bit, not overdone. Yeah. It's just good. Yeah. <laughs> it's, he's good. I like it. Yeah. Um, I just keep saying, yeah. The LeBeau line has a coconut. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, this one, like I'm really in the mood for it right now mm -hmm. because it's- It's like springtime. Yeah, it's springtime, like- it's Starting to heat up. Yeah. Yeah, and the bottle very- yeah. So like out of any of these, I gravitate towards just the look and the smell of this just automatically. Mm. Yeah, seasonality wise, like that one, this one, and this one, mm -hmm. and maybe this one. Kind of like the best for right now. That's good. Contrast and compare. <sighs> um... The world is your oyster. That makes sense. Oh, I don't like this atomizer. Oh yeah, it's good. I'm gonna put it right behind the, the most wanted. Right here. Yeah. And when we're done, you can go back and do a sniffer Okay. Rearrange as needed. Okay. Final finale. Gentlemen Society Extreme. Okay. What's that face? That's the face of me smelling iris. Mm-mm. No iris in this. I mean. I'm lying, there is. <laughs> <laughs> Something smells like it. It's got coffee too. That's wonderful. It's got coffee, you like coffee. <laughs> You're not gonna get me <laughs> to, pretty good. to go to the iris side. Mm -hmm. You either mm -hmm. love it or you hate it. Mm -hmm. You love it, mm -hmm. I hate it. Mm -mm. You, yes. just haven't, you just haven't smelled it enough yet. I mean, that could very well be a possibility that, you know, it's kind of like the taste of coffee. When you're little, you hate it. When you get older, you're like, oh my God, yes, I love coffee. No, I loved it when I was a child. No wonder why you're a crackhead. I'm, I'm playing I didn't like it when I was a child. I was lying to you. Um, so, I'm sorry, babe, but I gotta really hurt your feelings here. It's gonna go all the way to the back. It's going. It's going all the way. No, no. Uh, I just, you've got to like find somebody that appreciates Iris the way you do for them to smell this and actually be like, mm, yeah. And that's just not me. Smell like Play-Doh. 
Uh, yeah, it smells like lipsticky makeup and it's just not something I want to smell. Mm. Tasty Play-Doh. Okay, uh, so this is the ranking, but now I task you with quickly going through, re-smelling and, and contemplating is this where you want to cast your die? I will, but I'll also tell you that that's going to stay down there. Fine. Sorry. Do what you will. Okay. Why don't you do me a favor and start spraying the dry uh, openings back <laughs> spray down? The dry down yeah, spray the dry downs. Yeah, spray the spray the openings there. Okay. Are you done? Yes, I'm done. So nothing changed except why Elixir moved up. Oh wait, and that moved up. Mm -hmm. So this is your final ranking. The scent Elixir made it all the way to the end in first. Yeah. And you are certain about this. Absolutely. You are 100% sure about this. You know, actually on second thought, mm, I think the gentleman might be first. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so I actually ordered the new Boss Bottled uh, Triumph Elixir, so they, they're coming out with two elixirs this year, at least. Uh, so we'll see how that is. Maybe it's even better, but uh, this ranking is passable. Good. <laughs> because I, I did move up the, yeah, the tobacco one. Had to make sure it's what I smell in there. <laughs> right. <laughs> I did move that one up, and I did move that up. Uh-huh. But this is, this stands. Okay, yeah. Um, I, I'm honestly not even sure what my ranking would be. I mean, it would be, that would be probably a little, a little bit higher, maybe. Okay. Maybe, maybe a little bit. Uh, oh, okay. I'd be like, at least right here. <laughs> no, you would have it like top, at least top four, probably. Maybe. Mm, maybe. Maybe, I don't know. Okay. I'll have to see. Okay. So, uh, that's it. We'll do another one of these soon. Maybe. Okay. The stronger with you one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They'll all just all run together. Yeah. Because they, they got a lot of similarities. At yeah, a certain level, yeah. you'll just be like, it's... Uh, I'd be like uh, doing a video with just like all the aqua de Joes. Yeah, yeah. We could do that too. Yeah. Right. Uh, thank you guys for hanging with us. Stay safe up here. See you tomorrow with another fragrance video. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.